So right now we're about to start, I think it's the third mission in sequence eight. And that actually will unlock the final mission in this sequence. Hopefully they'll both be in this video. You see, I don't even know if this is a new video or what, but regardless, let's do this. Ah, this way, my dear. I've something to show you. Hop in. Where are we going? One of Starik's workshops, where they build weapons for his army. When the world is full of nasty things, we must tear those things apart. Walk on, girl. A man like Starik built a... Steady on. I must say that this has been my favorite set of missions in the game. Roth is probably one of my favorite characters just from the way he does things. I don't know, he just he's pretty much a bad guy. That's essentially it. He doesn't care if people get hurt either. Funk in you. you must see the potential, dear Jacob. This workshop is one of Sterics. Set the dynamite and let's blow it to atoms. Together. Okay, rig the workshop with dynamite in four different locations. Is there any other ones? Because it looks like I see six. Those two over there, those two down there, and those two right there. Unless there's... They're in sets of two, maybe? I don't know. Let's see. I think next chance I get, I'm going to go, but I guess before sequence 9 starts, I'll probably go and get... I'm not going to kill anybody. Don't even worry about that. He's running right to him. What a beast. Let's have a salvo. So you're supposed to pick those up and then care. Okay, never mind. Uh, I was looking at him wrong. It's pretty cool how you can see that. Thing is, now these enemies are actually a lot higher rank than what we're used to. Everything's been like six or less. These are spots you can pick it up. Okay, not you don't detonate them here. That is a door nail. You just I guess you just put them right here. Yeah, here we go. Oh shit. That's one. Okay. Makes sense. Get your boys to uh help you just clear out the area and then just do this. Shoot. This guy should drop. Yeah, he's about to get he's about to get destroyed. Good gracious. That's two of four. Okay, nice. Thing is technically I'm not killing anybody. Oh no! Set. Oh nice, it set itself! It's kinda funny. It's kinda fell out of my hands. Last one should be in this back corner. I don't know how I saw that, it was just blinking. And done. Man, the gang helping you? Is makes things so much easier. I would have had to stealth kill, kill like everybody there. All rigged up. Perfect. Let's put our plan into action. Stand back. 
Ready! Wait! Whatever for? There are children in there. Jacob, my dear. Starrick uses child labor to manufacture goods. We must put an end to his production line. But not like this. Why not? I can do whatever I damn well please. Soon, you will understand what it is to be free, as I am. Light him up, boys! No! What the hell are you doing? We're not playing games anymore, Roth! No. We're not. Holy shit! Come on, get up, get up, get up! If I have to fight people, that's gonna be brutal. Find a way out. What about this door right here? What? I can't go to the door because... Oh my goodness. Okay, I can't... Why, why would I not be able to do that, though? Let's go open this door. Can't they all just run out? Go, go, go! I might can get them all in two minutes. I think there's just a few that can't move. So I gotta rush. He was about to kill a bunch of kids. You're really gonna fight me? Trying to rescue children? A building you were already protecting. That's ridiculous. I don't get that at all. Complete this. Remember, I'm not trying to complete it. I'm trying to uh, rescue kids. Are you kidding? Oh, this kid's about to catch flames. Then this is how the human torch was born right here. Oh, no. Keep going. Nice. A gift, sir, from Mr. Roth. It's gonna be like something that tries to kill me, I bet. You should be warned, Mr. Fry, that when Roth is angry with one, he generally brings suffering to many. My dearest Jacob, alas, it seems our adventures together have come to a close. Although our time together was brief, it's left a lasting mark. I wish you well in all your future endeavors. Cordially, Maxwell. Post scriptum. I'm putting on a show this evening. All of London will be there. Enclosed, please find your invitation. Fun and games. I got everyone out in under two minutes. Alright, so the final mission for sequence eight. That was actually a short mission. Let's see where this next one's at. Uh, should be, like, right there with it, right? Hang on, let's see what pops up. Defense civilians. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Why not? <laughs> it's, it's on the way. Here it is. Final act. Now, this guy, as far as him being a favorite character of mine it was before he tried to like murder kids i just liked how he he's almost like the joker where he doesn't really care if people live or die he's kind of got that i guess monarchy kind of a pill all right here we go jacob must lo locate uh oh we basically gotta assassinate him now This way to the Alhambra! 
Okay, assassinate Maxwell Roth. My favorite villain so far. Uh, unique kill opportunity, waitress opportunity. Uh, let's see. If I get the assistance, it'll actually be kind of nice. So you don't actually have to do all of them. You're just supposed to infiltrate this. Alright, here we go. This is a pretty cool little area, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, you know what? I can't call a cart here, I don't think. Who's this? I'm supposed to get a mask, okay. I better kill these two guys first, let's see what happens. Get a little double kill action going on here. Why didn't it give me the double kill? What? Alright, let's see if we can get the mask. Nice. Loot the body. Could have sworn the other character also had one. This dude looks weird. All right. So just don't attract too much attention. Now if I can get to her. Now what does it mean by attracting too much attention? Like, let me go talk to her. I'm guessing she's gonna lead me in. Look at this horse, man. Horse trying to kill me. Alright, so I'm supposed to follow her, but not directly behind her. I can't call anybody to help, so let's see. That is essentially... My B, my B. This guy's about to straight up murder me. Did you see that? Alright, if I can find a way to kill these guys. See, the thing is, I blend in with everyone else. Let's try this. Oh shit, the horse just ran over me. Is that a corpse? That's fine. Doesn't matter. We're good. We're still good. That should be all the guys out front. Nice. All right, now we're finally in here. Reach the music hall's vantage point. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Alhambra Music Hall. Tonight, we have, for one night only, a very special performance of Corvus the Trickster. While some of the effects may be visceral and highly disturbing, do not be alarmed, my good people. Fear not. This is a purest form of entertainment. Tonight's performance immortalizes and is for the benefit of a young fellow very near and dear to my heart. Any concerns or complaints may be addressed to him. <laughs> Jacob, dear boy, tonight is for you.
we'll be serving you this evening, gentlemen. You're still here, love. Last time, I swear, you nearly poisoned us. Scene two, stand by. Let me out! I need to lower the grid for the show! Oh, we finally made it into this area. Kill Roth's decoys. What the hell? We have a volunteer. A big round of applause for this brave, brave man. Our volunteer is about to die for you, Jacob. You lucky people are about to witness this gentleman being fired upon at point blank range. Speak to the witch just to poison her pitcher. Our performer will hit several targets placed around his head. Exciting, is it not? You drink, sir? Mary, you're a sweet, sweet girl. Happens to be my job, sir. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you kindly. Will our honored guest go unharmed? It's fine. We're good. Since there's mayhem happening everywhere, it really doesn't. These guys is stuck anyways. It doesn't matter. That's what I'm talking about. First one's down. I gotta go speak to her so she can go poison. Are right, nice. She's going around the entire building, so that's good. She gonna come back out this door? Or no. Oh shit! She's gonna go all the way around. You kidding me? Damn it, man! Come on. I'm gonna take this dude over the balcony if I have to. Doesn't matter to me. Alright, it doesn't matter. I really am about to start just shooting people. Ooh. Holy shit, man. She's just walking past it like it never happened. Good thing is my medicine now gives me so much more. Alright, she she was just gonna kill those two on the top, it looks like. Now I got the other two left. See if I can assassinate this fool. If he's not wrong. You, you laugh, ladies and gentlemen, but I assure you that is the There's the machinist to make him lower the rafter. Nice. You have a flat head, Michael. What? I have no doubt that you could hazard a guess as to what this one concerns, my friends. Okay. Our courageous participant hasn't even flinched. He's by himself, it looks like. That was all four, right? Yeah, it was. Enjoyed your evening so far, ladies and gentlemen. I know I have. Now, before our final act, I would like to toast all you brave people who joined us tonight to celebrate life and death. Go on! 
Dude is an absolute psychopath, and I love it. Come here, bitch! The, was, it that, was it that easy? What? Darling, what a night. The stuff of legends. Why did you do it? All of it. What? Snap a baby crow's neck between my thumb and forefinger. Slice to bits the ones you deem innocent. Keep the world in its divine, manic state. For the same reason, I do anything. Why not? <laughs> You gotta be kidding. You gotta escape this in 90 seconds or less. Oh my goodness, entry points over here. I always get caught up watching the cutscenes. Oh no, you gotta be kidding. What about all the people in here though? Like, are we just gonna ignore that they need to not die? <laughs> you know, like, what? What a nightmare. This is gonna get covered up too. Yep. I thought so. This mission actually reminds me of the very start of Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, I don't know if that makes any sense, but... Wow, this place is coming down quick, guys. I'm gonna get burned. Holy shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Was it 90 seconds? I can't believe I actually got everything done on that one. Order has bred disorder. The sea rises to flood the pubs and extinguish the street lamps. Our city will die. Tupane has failed, Lucy. Has failed. Brudenell Elliotson. Pearl. All have gone into the night. It is up to me now. The assassins have brought nature's fury into our homes. Men have become monsters. Barreling toward us. Teeth out. Our civilization must survive this onslaught. To prevent a return of the Dark Ages, I will start anew. London must be reborn. Sean. 
We'll position ourselves near the palace, but we'll wait for you to sync the genetic data before we move. It's all up to you, Initiate. You're late. Staric is making his move. The Peace of Eden is somewhere inside Buckingham Palace. Let him have it. I've seen your handiwork across the city. Perhaps you should trust my judgment. I've been killing Staric's henchmen. What have you been doing? Let's ask Henry, shall we? I have been repairing your mistakes. Too much haste is too little speed. Don't you call father at me. That's Plato. And I am sorry this doesn't involve anything you can destroy. Father was right. He never approved of your methods. Father is dead! Enough! I have just received word from my spies. At the palace ball tonight, Staric plans to steal the piece of Eden and then eliminate all the heads of church and state. Once more for all time's sake. And then we're finished. Agreed. So what's the plan? Such an unexpected delight to visit you both. What is the news on the street? Mrs. Disraeli, we have discovered that there is something inside Buckingham Palace that could threaten the... <laughs> what my sister's failing to say is that we require entrance into the ball tonight. Impossible! Even if there were any invitation cards remaining, which there are not, uh, someone of your lowly station... If that damn fool Gladstone is attending this evening, they can have my card. Perfect. Then I'll go alone. Mrs. Disraeli, if you'd be kind enough to inform my darling brother of the location of the Gladstone's residence, perhaps he could use his considerable skills to commandeer their carts. <laughs> what fun! Did you hear that, Dizzy? We're going to pinch the Gladstone's invitations. Thank you for volunteering me, sweet sister. Oh, a pleasure, brother, dearest. Now, Mrs. Disraeli, if you would excuse me, I must visit with the Maharaja. It occurs to me that he may have a second set of plans to a certain vault. So check this out. I'm not sure this might be one of the last few videos. It could be the very last one. I don't know. It might be a long one. It might be a short one. I have no idea yet. Uh, but what I do know is that we're about to start Sequence 9 uh, right now. And that's, I guess, the way the progress log has worked. So we've went through and pretty much killed all the Templar conspiracy villains, I guess you'd call them. Now we got the final guy, Crawford. And let's see, where's it at? Yeah, there's four parts to this. There's four four memories in this sequence, so it actually all starts right here. So let's see how this goes. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Uh, as promised, I will be finishing this game. So they must have taken the invitations with them. Speak with the kid. I don't know how this guy got with me. I think I just like. Hopped in a cart and he was there. You wouldn't happen to have seen two carriages pass by here just now. I did, sir. One with a man in it, the other with a woman. They split up. Where did the man go? That way. Thank you. Reach Mr. Gladstone's location. Alright. I'll just take this right quick. I guess this guy that's been just chilling with me, I guess I'll keep him there. Oh, you, you can actually go this way. Nice. It's been a hell of a game, um, <clears throat> definitely a lot longer than last year's game. I guess if you count Unity and Rogue as one, maybe it's about the same length, but this definitely has been a lot longer of a game, and uh, I don't know. I would compare the length of this game probably to like Batman Arkham Knight. I don't know, maybe like a 16 hour, maybe 20 hour game, possibly. Uh, but this one's more... I, d I don't know. It definitely is a step up, I think, from last year's Assassin's Creed game. I can't believe after I beat this, this will be the fourth... The, yeah, the fourth Assassin's Creed game I've completed on my channel. It's like a yearly tradition, almost. That and Call of Duty, really. <laughs> Which is honestly one of the main reasons I wanted to complete this before starting that, so... I'm on the right track. 
Now, do we need to stay in this cart, or can we just... Oh, wow, what's going on? Oh, wait, here we go. A private party event. Don't mind if I do. Oh, the level eight. Holy shit. That's gonna be bad. I'm gonna go up top. I gotta really be stealthy here. Alright, I called for some help. Nice. Still the invitation. There's somebody behind me. Yep, of course. It's over, bitch! This actually gives me a chance to loot all the bodies, get some more stuff. Ammunition. Perfect. That's fine. Bring him on. Bring him on, gentlemen. Now, I can steal it without having to be anonymous, right? Because it really shouldn't matter. Oh, you- Oh, you kidding me? Well, it's all-out warfare now, I guess. It really doesn't matter. They've kind of went a whole different route with it introducing, like, the gang stuff in this game. Become anonymous to continue. I got a few more blues right here. Guess I could go ahead and kill one of these for them. Instead of making them do all the work. The, you know what's bad is... They almost don't even reward you for being stealthy in this game. Which I think is a crying shame if you ask me. Nice, got the invitation. There's no, there's not even any sense in staying. All right, here we go. So now we're finit. Now, now we're getting her invitation. So, I actually thought the soundtrack for this game was actually really well done as well. What just happened? I haven't been quite as delicate as I could have been, but still. Sometimes a GPS thing pops up, sometimes it doesn't. This is one of those times where it will not. How much time left till we can call a cart? Right now. Let's go, boys. This is Gladstone's under guard. Better be cautious. Better wait until she's alone. Looks like it's like the train station almost. I honestly can't tell at this point. Ah. She's gonna run if we get spotted, so I'm gonna go up top. Now is my chance. Now the thing is, can I kill her? Oh no, it should, it's actually behind her, never mind. I can throw knives and kill everyone around her, maybe. The two in the back? Most definitely. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Take a little bit of damage, that's fine. She doesn't see me yet. Got it. One should not attend the Queen's ball without making a proper entrance. Hijack her, uh, her carriage. Where is it at? Oh, this one's brown bread. oh we gotta get back down. Nice. I think as far as the Assassin's Creed games go, I still think that as far as the way they play, I think that's, that's a huge reason why I think some of them fell, some of them don't and I honestly feel like the fourth one black black flag I think definitely just the takes the cake in that what's this 
swords must be left at the door by order of the Queen. Freddy will know what to do. Do not damage it at all. Oh, well, I'll have to see how that goes, because I'm about to hit the boost. Ooh, hang on. I'm going to see if I can get this. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Oh, shit. Oh, never mind. It damaged it. It's going to take it away. Unless hitting the will doesn't count. Maybe that's what I just did. Yep, there it goes. Accidentally bumped into the street light thing. It was actually kind of a random mission. Like, I, I felt like something else was about to happen. But I guess it won't, so... Dress to impress. Yeah, it must just be a two-part mission. Quiet cabbage you got there. Where did you buy it, if, if you don't mind me asking? Ask all you want, Freddy. You'll never get an answer. Damn it all. Was it my eyebrows? Yes. And your face, voice, and body. Look, I've got an invitation to the Queen's Ball tonight. How did you come by that? Freddy, there's to be an attack on the ball. I need to smuggle some weapons inside to prevent it. Supposing I believe you, only the Royal Guard carries weapons. So? Too easy. For God's sake, Freddy. Fine. I require a guard's uniform. Done. I knew you'd come through. Just promise me, Jacob, that you will return Mr. Gladstone's coach? Of course. Reach St. Martin Church. Wait, it's up there. All right. I thought for a minute I'd have to get in the carriage and keep going. One of my favorite things about this game is how they introduced... I don't, I don't know if this was in one of the older ones or not, but I know in the past few Assassin's Creed games, there has not been... a little grappling hook thing. I don't know if I just got to the top with this one. Hang on. Did I make it? Yes, I did. Knock out a royal guard. Holy shit, you see his hat? Good gracious. Now if I could actually zip line, which I can. I gotta line it back up again. It's like it almost worked. There it goes. Okay. So the side objective is to not kill anyone, which uh, let's see. We'll see how that goes. Now, now, well, while, while this is the first guy we see, he's probably not going to be the easiest to kill. Or not to kill, but to knock out. What about this guy? Oh, he's actually talking to someone else. Never mind. I guess they predict everyone's going to go for that first guy. And I'm thinking, maybe this guy in the back might be... Let's see. Alright, it's on the other side of that door. There's three guards there. Where's this fool going? I don't want to assassinate anybody. That's the thing. Okay, he's going by himself. Nice. Alright, here we go, guys. Moment of truth. Here we go. Oh, 
Hopefully no nobody sees this. So I did try to get the guy all the way in the back. Uh, the problem was I wound up killing everybody. So, yeah. Charming. Now to hide the body. Hide the body. All right. And I'm getting spotted now by trying to hide the body. Doesn't even matter now. Hide the body in a carriage. That's gonna go over well. Holy shit! Look at all the enemies around me. It's time to go, boys. I'm gonna have to go back for this body later. It is not happening. Stay near the live target. I'm trying to. Please don't get near me. He asked for it, I guess. Alright, now's my chance since all my guys are here. It's no longer like 1v20, so here we go. I gotta hide his body in a carriage. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Ready? Here I come. I've actually got to go to the store and uh, purchase like some health and everything. I have no more stuff for resupply. I'm out of knives. I got, I got plenty of bullets, but these guys do so much damage with the health. Oh my goodness. I'm on the move, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm anonymous, really? I think I'm anonymous now, right? As soon as it stops blinking yellow, we're good. One uniform as requested. It's still warm. My gift to you? I will meet you on the roof of Buckingham Palace. You're such a romantic. I don't know about you guys, but these past two missions have kind of just been, like, building up to something big. I'm thinking that's where this is going. We just did two missions and it hasn't even been a 20 minute video yet, so the good thing is I'll probably be able to do the rest of this game in this video. So, family politics. Guess we'll go there. Alright, I'll see you guys there in one second. There was something over there, hang on. Oh no, it's not, never mind. Alright, so I'm at the next mission start, but what I needed to get before we do anything is some more, I guess, like health items and stuff. Because all I have right now is plenty of bullets. Actually, let me see something. Actually, I actually think I might be okay. Let's see how this plays out. Delighted to see you again, Miss Fry. Your Highness, the plans detailing the renovations to Buckingham Palace have gone astray. I suppose you will have to make do with the copies. There are copies? Where? Uh, not so fast. First, I have a matter of some urgency. Carrying out my plan would require stealth and speed, qualities I know you possess. Time is of the essence, Your Highness. Then make this quick, my dear. The most influential men in Parliament remain beyond my reach. But these very men have sent for carriages to prepare for the ball tonight. Acquire an official carriage, and we shall drive the politicians to their destinations. Along the way, I will meet with them. And afterward, I shall tell you where to find the plans. You're a shrewd negotiator. One must be when one is so often underestimated. Borrow a royal carriage. Hang on, before we do anything else, you already know the drill. 20 points, are you kidding? We'll go ahead and get these. This is what's been saving me. The adrenaline and this last one, the combat stamina. I should use almost half of them. It brings me to 7, that's good. Because I think the recommended level for this entire thing right now is... uh. Really, first strike almost outright kills an enemy. I will definitely purchase that. How is that 
part of stealth, though, you know? I guess I don't really understand that one too much. All right, we should be good. The mission. What a mistake. I'm just glad that nobody seems to care when I still stuff around here. Okay, bar. It says borrow. It says you can steal one without entering the courtyard. What? There you are. Oh shit. This isn't one, is it? Let's just see what this says. Nope. Okay. I don't know exactly what it looks like, so I guess that's what I'm going to have to find out. I got didn't even care I was there. What is this business? A lot of the stealth aspects of this game are how I've actually been playing it, at least. Uh, remind me of the Metal Gear Solid series I did earlier, like last month. Man, there's no intruder up here. What are you talking about, sir? Okay, it doesn't matter if you kill people, which is good, because I need a lot of items. These guys must have a lot of everything. Thing is, if I don't have time to visit a shop, I'll just do this instead. Oh, this guy's gonna see me in front. Oh, shit! That's fine. Go ahead and hop up here. You know you want to. Got him! His hat came off. What is that? I'm just going to outright steal this thing. Here we go, guys. They're going to chase me. That's not an issue. How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, no. Oh, shit. Entry point right here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, carriage. Don't... Okay, don't let it drop below 50%. Oh, shit, guys. Everybody's looking. Everyone's watching. Oh, that's not good. I'm guessing that all the way back, I'm going to get, like, jumped by a ton of people. Oh, let's squeeze through here. No! Oh, come on. I don't want to be too reckless, but I don't want anybody to catch up with me. I wonder sometimes if the GPS, because there's been a couple of different occasions where it's like said I can only go a certain way. And like there's no exceptions. I just kind of wonder if that's even something that is the way this game is set up or what. Climb up, Your Highness. Where are we headed? That's just a side objective. It really doesn't matter if you get the side objectives because those really just give you the experience. The exclusive items usually just come from completing the mission itself. Welcome, sir. Your Highness, what a surprise. <laughs> Is life not about embracing the unexpected? I shall take but a few moments of your time. A matter of utmost importance must be discussed. When the Commonwealth seized the Punjab from my people... It was not a seizure, but a rightful transaction. Britain promised to protect me. By robbing me of my kingdom, Parliament acted in violation of the treaty signed with my family. Here, read it. I... I was not aware. Read. That is all I ask. You are one of the few in a position to help. I will do what I can. 
I trust you and your son will enjoy the ball this evening. He is newly returned from Delhi. I will share what we have discussed. It is most disconcerting. That proved quite valuable. Where to now? St. James's Park. I noticed Mr. Green did not accompany you. He has other things to attend to. Ah, a pity. You two seem to get along nicely. Well, that was a problem, you see. One must not allow our personal feelings to compromise one's mission. That sounds like a quotation. It is. From my father. Ethan Fry. You knew him? No, unfortunately. But Mr. Green spoke of him. He sounded like an extraordinary man. He was, Your Highness. And your mother as well, Cecily Fry. She and your father were partners, inseparable. The only duo that came close to challenging Mr. Scarrick. And very much in love, at least from the small amount I have been told. Cecily. I wish I could have met her. From what Mr. Green gathered, you share much in common. Your intelligence, for one. Father never spoke of me. What would Mr. Green do? He was only a boy when he trained with my father. Children can be quite perceptive, Miss Fry. Almost drove us right into the river. <laughs> or the lake or whatever the hell this is. A little pond. Yes, sir. Good day, sir. Why, what are you doing here, your highness? I know how busy your days have been of late. A few moments of your time is all I require. This is all rather unorthodox, but continue. Britain was to protect me according to the treaty my family signed. Instead, she took my land. And now I hear Britain intends to strengthen her ties to India. Perhaps it is time to return the Punjab to her people. The Queen has supplied you with an annual income for God knows how long, and now you bite the hand that feeds you? It is not a matter of money. I cannot stand idle and watch my homeland. Good day, sir. May God bless you. Dang, I was too fast. I didn't even finish talking. I don't know. Now where? Only one more remains. To the Gladstone residence. Do you miss India? I remember that my mother smelled of cinnamon. And when she cradled me in her arms in the summer heat, I would hold so still that she fell asleep. When I lost my kingdom, it hurt. But truly, when they took my mother away... Atta girl. Good day, Mr. Gladstone. Mr. Singh! You are a hard man to pin down. I know what this is about. Your politics have worn off. The Majesty is tired of you. So now you come begging for scraps. You wound me deeply, sir. My people deserve freedom. I am here to fight for them. Why did you lose the Punjab? I shall tell you, Your Highness. You were outgunned, outmaneuvered, and simply outclassed. Yes, the Sikhs deserve freedom. I hope with British help and progress, they shall achieve it. Then why do they cry out for their king? Britain has a duty to bring about peace. It is an enormous responsibility. And I value your guidance and advice, along with that of Parliament. But it's our burden. Much luck, Your Highness, with your lobbying. I hope my advice has done some good. Far more than your policies thus far. But I hold out hope that you will make progress. My people are counting on it. Thank you, Miss Fry, for forwarding my cause. Oh, you are welcome. I hope some good comes of it, despite Mr. Gladstone's vitriol. Those of us with the largest hearts protect them the most. Your father, for instance. From what I understand, he was extraordinarily sad. Broken, even, after your mother's passing. That kind of pain can blind us. Cause us to say outlandish things to protect the ones we love. It's time you returned this carriage and recovered those plans. 
They are located in Buckingham Palace. The Queen keeps them among her personal papers in the white drawing room. I wish you a good evening, Miss Evie Fry. And to you, Your Highness. Return it? Are you kidding? Why would we need to? Okay, never mind. I'm not even gonna question it. So this, I guess, after this mission is there's the ending, really. All the, it's, I'm hopefully all gonna put this in one video. So it. it's kind of good that the these three missions didn't even take up that much time because one long finale. Let's go. go on. Hopefully, we just return this like. I don't know. Let's see. Go. <laughs> now. Are we good? Hang on. Let's see what happens. I thought I just returned it. That guy just happened to be right there. What? Why would they make it to where I can get spotted while trying to finish the mission? It's good, right? Are you kidding me? I gotta inch it forward, probably. I guarantee that's what it is. Oh, you gotta keep going in here. I thought that was it, though. A little the worse for wear. Nice. All right, now I can run for my life again. See, you, bitch. I'm gonna die. There's too many of them. Oh my goodness! Go, 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 go. These guys are on full sprint. Alright, we should be fine. Oh, that was close. Nice, family politics. See, I got half of it. All it is is just the XP reward. You still get the cape and everything. Cloak of victory. Let's see what this last mission shows. A night to remember. Now, let me see something really quick. If I'm not mistaken, that is the final mission. So, yeah, that's it. All right, guys, without further ado, let's do this. I'll see you guys there.